<laughs> Week 27 of our marathon training. Here it is. This is it. This is, it. This is our last run before the marathon. So stick around. We're going to talk about some cool things today. Just wait. Hey, we have uh, just a, a little a over two to go. Exactly, to, two and a half. Oh, two and a half to finish our seven for today. And we were saying to ourselves, ooh, less than three more of those, marathon. So, you know. The seven, not the two and a half. Yeah, the seven. <laughs> yeah. Um, it's, uh, our run started at 55 degrees. Really, really nice. Uh, it was cold at night, starting to warm up. The sun's pretty warm, but it's a really nice day, so it's great to get out today. A lot of people out. All right, back to it. We'll finish this up and then recap time. Hey, week 27 in the books. You just watched our run this morning of seven miles. Oh my gosh, we leave in five days. Five days. We're going to be in Florida with thousands of other people. We are looking forward to seeing everybody, all of you. Man, this is pretty cool. Yeah. Pretty cool. The, one, yeah. Uh, the run went uh, well today. And we think, oh man, that our weather here today is going to be very much like it's going to be in Florida, which is much better than it's been in years past. Much better than years past. It was it got warmer. Warm. Yeah, it got warm. Warmer than, it, than it's been for a while, but that's okay. It's okay. It's probably going to be what it's like. Yeah. Yeah. So. I, I mean, whatever it is, we're going to be out there yeah. and we're going to be doing it. Mm -hmm. uh, but hopefully, you know, a little cooler. A uh, uh, high of 70 would be awesome. That's the forecast. Uh, Every, things can change. Yeah, yeah, of course. But it's looking pretty decent yeah, right now. Yeah. Pretty decent. Um, you know, we said we'd have an update on uh, costumes. Oh my gosh, we finished our costumes, and oh my gosh, oh. it was torture. It was a, it was an ordeal. And, and just, <laughs> it was just, awful. just to give you a taste of what happened. Oh my gosh. Uh, we told you we have a vinyl cutter, right? You, you put vinyl in it. And uh, you, you input a design, you know, whether it's, you know, I mean, it could be any design. And, and the cutter will, you know, feed the vinyl in and it cuts it. And they're amazing. It, it's amazing how wonderfully it'll do whatever design you input. Um, and so we put our first design in the cutter and our machine, which we have had for, I don't know, a little over a year. We've used maybe six times. It broke. <laughs> It, Wait, it like broke. fed in wonky and the design printed and it was all wrong like circles were oh ovals my and God. so we had to uh we had to figure fix out what it. was going on yeah, it was weird 
It's a very, uh, uh, apparently... According to YouTube, a very common problem with this very model. Very common problem. And uh, so we had to, you know, figure that out and monitor it for every single cut. You know, basically what we do is you feed it in, you walk away, you do something else, and when it's done, it spits it out, and it's like, oh, cool. Uh, so that was uh, that was the first major hurdle we had yeah, to that cross. was several hours. Yeah. Um, and then uh, just, uh, you know, you, you look at something, you know, we put together a design... <laughs> I based the oh, I based the design on on the the Neutron movie, and, and I, you know you try to get it to work with what you're wearing, and and you know we want it to to be visible, uh, and we bought the uh, the glow in the dark vinyl. Uh -huh. Matter of fact, here's a shot. It it, it really it looks, looks it looks fantastic. Really cool. it looks we don't cool. know how long it's gonna glow. Yeah. What, our plan is to like leave our like hang our our outfits in the bathroom with both front and back exposed to the light uh -huh. leave the light on you know All overnight yeah. and just like charge it up yeah. because it looks really neat yeah it, it really does it looks it really really, does. really neat so well, that's great yeah um but <laughs> man it was it was okay. an ideal what else what else made it so awful so we worked on it like all day half of our day on thursday and all like all day on friday yeah and it just it took it, it was tough man you five know, times longer than we thought it would do it, you know it's more information than you'd care to know really but you, you know was, you have to you cut it you and then you, it you, and you weed, weed you know you take off all the pull the extras, negative space out basically yeah. and then you put it on and where it's you sticky, want it to go so it's supposed yeah, to stick so. but on athletic shirts yeah, it, it didn't stick so we're like yeah you know, I'm trying to... and then it's heat press right you don't like peel and stick you put it on there you position it then you have to put it in a heat press or an iron we have a heat press <laughs> Uh, you, know, you put it on there. Well, if it moves, you got to start all over again. And because... then we're doing mirror images. So you want both sides to be the same, which means everything you did over here, <laughs> you got to figure out how to make it look the same on the I other know. side. And guess what? T-shirts aren't uh, symmetrical. You uh, think they are. No, they're not. They're not. They're, they're not. Exactly symmetrical. So it's like, oh, man. So, you know, just getting the mirror image to work front and then back and then front and then back. Uh, we were... We were working for a long time. And then we finished the top. So the top half of my dress, which I built on Tuesday and tested out on Wednesday, mm -hmm. it did okay. Mm -hmm. And your shirt, we did. And our, our original plan was to do the skirt and your shorts. And we hit a point like mid early afternoon on Friday. And I was like, I'm done. Yeah. We're not, we're yeah. not doing our shirts. That's fine. Yeah. And so we went yeah. out and we had some French fries and some queso and a beer. <laughs> yeah. And then we came back and we finished it. So we actually pulled yeah. off. The bottoms as well. Yeah, yeah, we did. <laughs> and the thing, the the other thing is, our original design kind of got thrown out the window because you know the now you're working on actual clothes. Yeah, it's way like, off. Man. It's like, why is it so small? Why is it so skinny? So uh, if done. you see us, if you see us, even if you think just, it looks, just tell us it looks. Yeah, great, just please. you know, give, give us a pat on the back. <laughs> it was <laughs> such. So much pain and suffering. But the glow in the dark is so cool. Yeah. Anyway, so update. Okay. We got our uh, we got our costumes. costumes are done. We need to talk about bathrooms. Bathrooms. Okay. So here's here's my uh, here's here's my run Disney soapbox that I'll get up on. Okay. The bathrooms in the parks are open during the races, which is wonderful yeah, it is. because but, I hate porta potties. Yeah. A whole lot. Yeah. Again. Someday, if we're not publishing this, if we ever see you and we like, mm -hmm. you know, grab we'll, a drink we'll or whatever, share a we'll stories. tell you about our horror yeah. stories. We both have yeah. plenty. Uh, and I'm guessing you, you do you too. You probably <laughs> do too. They're awful. Yeah. I hate them. Yeah. I hate them. But the bathroom. But you got to do it. But the so, park bathrooms are. But in the nice. park. But the thing is, it takes several miles to get to them. Right. Okay. Rule number one. First of all, you can you can hit the bathrooms in the park. That's cool. Yeah. What? Or at TTC, there's a bathroom there too, or outside mm -hmm. the parks. I think we're even running past, uh, what is it, the one at Epcot? We're running that that one that's outside. Oh, we're yeah. gonna run past that. Oh, yeah. So here's here's the thing. Here's my greatest recommendation for using the park bathrooms. Don't use the first one you come across, because thousands of other people have had the same idea <laughs> and are probably in line in front of you. Yeah. So um, I tried to get like the maps together. I'll still try to do this like production <laughs> we'll see if i get this together in time to like get this into the video but if not just remember these words so when we're going into epcot like i said we pass that one that's just outside of like the entrance yep. my guess is that's going to be like through the nose crowded mm -hmm. right because that's the first one that's like mile three mm -hmm. 
everybody's hydration is hitting them. We all got to go. Skip that one. It's like... Skip it. Uh, bladder's calling. Yeah. <laughs> what is that ring? <laughs> it's like an old-timey phone. Do you like crank that or something? <laughs> yeah. yeah, for those of you who may not know, this, this is a phone. Uh, that's a dial tone. <laughs> oh, yeah? Click. Uh, anyway... Skip that first one. Okay. So we're going to run in. Um, we're going to run, I think, like under the ball. Mm -hmm. Is there Spaceship a better Earth. word? Thank you. Spaceship Earth. Um, <laughs> you know, the Epcot ball. Yeah, Everybody big, knows what I'm yeah, talking about. The big glowy ball. So there's actually like big bathrooms on either side of that. Yeah. That's an option. Yeah. There's also another bathroom like kind of as we're working towards. Um, we're like uh, mission space is like right ahead. There's a bathroom right oh, there. That yeah. might be a good one, too, because that's like the third or fourth bathroom we're yeah. going to hit. Don't go to the first one. Yeah. Okay, so that's Epcot. Magic Kingdom. Do not go to the first bathroom that you hit in Magic Kingdom for two reasons. First of all, the first bathroom rule. So that'll be like mile 10, right? Mm -hmm. So everybody's like second round of bladder is going to hit. Yeah. Uh, the first bathroom that you hit, so we come in kind of backstage and we hit Main Street, right? And then we go turn and we go towards Tomorrowland. Tomorrowland. Um, the bathroom right by Anti Gravities, that uh, the soft serve, that yogurt shop, um, that's the first one that you like naturally run across. It, in addition to everybody stopping there, is smaller mm -hmm. than the other bathrooms mm -hmm. in the park. So skip that one. If you really, really, really got to go, I would say hit this the bigger one over by Space Mountain. Yeah, right. Like go back, backtrack a little bit. Yeah. Um, but if you don't want to do that, like we're running through. The entire park, basically. Right. So this year's route like goes all through Magic yeah. Kingdom. Just go to another one. Yeah. Like skip the first one, go to the second or the third mm -hmm. that you hit, you'll be fine. Yep. But that first one uh, in our first marathon, this is when I like came to this realization. Even though we had done two um, Star Wars runs, where I realized in retrospect we had the same issue going into um, Animal Kingdom. I always hit the first bathroom, and I always regretted it. But it wasn't until our first marathon when I hit the first bathroom in Magic Kingdom. And I was there for like 10 minutes yeah. waiting in the line yeah. and getting in and out of there. Yeah. And it just, it really like chips away your time, mm -hmm. especially if you're slow pokes like us and you're yeah. already looking at, you know, six plus hours. Yeah. Like, do I really want to waste 10 minutes at the bathroom right. for no reason other than go to the bathroom? So anyway, skip the first one, hit the next one. Um, Animal Kingdom probably won't be as bad because by that point we're so spread out. I yeah. think that's like my 16 yeah. right yeah so i i haven't had problems on this race doing the first bathroom in animal kingdom which is near everest expedition everest yeah. it's right around there yeah like in that like himalayan uh -huh. area yeah and those are good bathrooms yeah that one's okay there we're also we'll also hit the ones in um dino oh yeah oh, those, yeah. those are okay too those were nice bathrooms too okay so that's that part okay hollywood studios again by this point we'll be pretty thin if you're in the back of the pack like us yeah. we'll be a pretty thin crowd mm -hmm. like kind of spread sorry spread, <laughs> spread out a little bit because we hit such a small amount of hollywood studios you really only have that one in the park which is the one by um tower of terror, tower of terror. <clears throat> um but we're gonna run right by the ones outside the park so the ones kind of by skyliner that would probably be a better option i think those are big big bathrooms too mm -hmm. so um if you can get all the way through the park that's where to go and then of course by the time we get back to epcot we're running the entire world showcase so you have lots of options there that's my bathroom analysis It's good stuff, seriously. Because don't do the first bathroom in the park. You know, it. You can you can literally spend ten minutes at a bathroom. Would you like to do that, or try to find a bathroom where you're going to spend three minutes and then take that seven minutes you have and maybe try to get a character or picture or mm -hmm. something? We spent yeah. way too much time in the bathrooms, and you know, it's like everybody needs to use a bathroom, but some of those bathrooms, like the one in Tomorrowland, that one, uh, it, 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 they're too small. Yeah. And so you're really going to, man, and, and you know, I don't know about you, but when you got to go, you got to go. So once your mind says, oh, I'm going here, then, you know, there's, there's mm -hmm. no turning back and, yeah. and you're just kind of stuck there for too long. So if you can, uh, you know, try mm -hmm. try to try to wait for the next the one, one or or you know the optional ones because the one over by Space Mountain, uh, you know, it's a little off the mm -hmm. off the 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 course, 
but it's there and and a lot of people won't go there because you know oh well here's this one right here so mm -hmm. yeah good yeah. stuff and and uh it can it can really it can really make a difference uh, yeah so yeah thank you yeah. that's our plan yeah yeah oh okay okay so we did costumes we did bathrooms mm -hmm. we're leaving in five days we are leaving in five days uh oh. we're we're getting there. Uh, the uh, expo merchandise will all be gone by the time we get there. <laughs> yeah. it, it, that, that's just the way it is. Uh, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, but you know, that's, that, okay. that's okay. We'll go look. Yeah, well, okay. and, and you may have seen the uh, merch drop on uh, social media. We saw some stuff on Instagram. Mm. We saw some uh, stuff on uh, Facebook. And uh, you know, if you're really into uh, uh, the look of uh, 30 years ago, uh, I bet you you're just loving it. And that's all we'll say oh, we'll about leave that. that. We'll leave that there. Yeah. Um, yeah. Well, I mean, we're hoping for some mugs. We like ceramic coffee mugs. Uh, we're hoping for a pen. Yeah. Um, we didn't get, we haven't got, oh, no, we did get one of the first marathon, didn't we? Yeah, we did the first one. I'm looking at our pin wall. Yeah. yeah, but we didn't get one last Yeah, time. you know how they make a, a, a miniature pin of the, uh, the metal. Uh, we like to get one yeah. of those, but we didn't, uh, I mean, again, we get there so late, everything's gone. And that's fine. Uh, so uh, thank you in advance if uh, <laughs> you know who we're talking about. Uh, thank you. We have we have one, one so, set of so, friends who so have very graciously friends, agreed yeah. to look for <laughs> some mugs for us. Um, uh, okay, so we're going to do the expo, and then we're going to get our shirts, get our bibs, mm -hmm. hang out at Epcot for the day, and then... Relax on Saturday morning or relax on Saturday. We're pretty sure, TBD, but pretty sure that we're going to go cheer on the half marathoners. That's right. On Saturday morning. We got to get up early the next day anyway. So, you know, we get up early in real life here. So let's just like keep this train rolling. Yep. Um, so we're hoping to be able to go cheer on on Main Street. So if you are doing dopey or if you're only running the half marathon, Keep we'll be out. there. Hopefully, we'll be there. I've got some clackers. Oh, they should be here. Yeah, they were supposed to we ordered some uh, little clackers. Da, da, yeah. da, da, da. And um, uh, we'll be yelling yeah, out and uh, cheering on strangers. Yeah, if you see us, you know, more power to you. It's awesome, dopey. That's uh, man. That's that's quite a that's quite a feat. So oh, hey. or goofy. That's the other one. If you're doing oh yeah, goofy, goofy too. as well. Then I see. Uh, so uh, look for us on Main Street. I mean, there's a lot to look. at. Yeah. We're the last thing you really yeah, want. Yeah, you're looking for. at the castle. I get it, we'll but we may there. be there cheering for yeah, you. Yeah, we'll be there cheering you on. Uh, yeah. So that's great. Uh, we haven't received, uh, like many of you, our, our uh, uh, information on corrals or anything, but uh, I don't know, spoiler alert, we're going to be in the last one. We'll corral. be in the last one. So whatever the last one is, that will be us. That, was, that will be us. It's going to be party corral. So if you're in there with us, know that uh, <laughs> we, we are going to be the, uh, the most Woo! fun corral of the whole uh, marathon. Yeah, we'll do our best to uh, you know just stay excited, but not blow all our energy before uh, before the run starts. Yeah, we're pretty excited about that. Uh, we're also hoping to actually publish a video next Saturday. Yep, we'll see. Yeah, we'll have a little uh, you know maybe some expo footage and some park footage and some uh, cheering on footage. Yeah, so we'll, we'll do our best uh, as long as we have a good connection, we can get the uh, video uploaded. Uh, otherwise, mm -hmm. it'll be the following week. Yeah, uh, and and we'll yeah. uh, more than likely sp split up the videos. We'll have a pre-marathon and then marathon. Uh, and our plan is to get as much footage as possible of the marathon, of the mile markers, of the sights, of the sounds. Mm -hmm. uh, heck, we're even going to do a FaceTime call with somebody so uh, yeah. we can uh, have a, uh, you know, kind of a, a neat, hey, look where we are and uh, look around. So, uh, but we'll have all of that uh, at a minimum the week following the marathon. Yeah. You know, one thing uh, uh, we were talking about, too, you know, once the marathon comes and goes, it doesn't mean our running adventure is over, right? We're still going to keep running. Mm -hmm. We still have all these destinations, uh, uh, running destinations that we want to do. Yeah, we're local, but, you know. Yeah, and, you know, there are some uh, there are some bucket list uh, destinations yeah. that we've talked about uh, where we want to do, uh, you know, uh, an awesome run somewhere we've never been and, and then share it with you. So, uh, you know, stick with us. And, again... If you haven't subscribed and you're watching, subscribe. Uh, it doesn't doesn't really hurt, but we love it. And uh, you know, if you like the video, hit like. Uh, we do our best to upload. 
once a week. And we're going to continue doing that as yeah. we continue our running adventures. And hopefully sign up for next year's race, but we all know how um, oh, man. volatile of a prospect that is. Um, yeah, so yeah, we'll keep, we'll keep trying. Yeah. So let us know in the comments what you think of our uh, costumes. Uh, you know, you saw a little a snippet of some uh, glow-in-the-dark action. You know, you'll see us as you pass us. So, uh, you know, say hi. <laughs> <laughs> say hi. Um, uh, I am, I, and I got this crazy thought. I was like, well, maybe now I need to hand paint more design on the... I uh, told them. No, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Let us know what you think. Let us know how you're doing. Let us know if you've already left. I mean, maybe you've already left. Yeah. Uh, we're going to see you. We are so looking forward to it. This is it. This I is can't it. believe it. I know. I can't believe I know. it. I know. went by so fast. I know. You know, and there have been some uh, ups and downs. Uh, you know, that uh, massive uh, once-in-a-lifetime uh, storm that hit the United States had messed up air travel. And we were kind of like, ooh, yeah. are, are we going to? So I, it, it's looking good. Really? It's looking good. I think we'll be okay again, <laughs> one way or another. We're going to see you for Marathon 2023. Oh, Happy New Year. Hey, Happy New happy Year. Happy New Year, everybody. I keep forgetting it's New Year's Eve. Yeah, Happy New Year. Uh, you know, do what we're going to do. Uh, sit around, watch a movie, uh, drink some uh, bubbly, and uh, hope for a much yeah beer. Hope for a much <laughs> better year. All right, everybody. We'll see you. Say hi. Remember. See you in a week. It's always an adventure <laughs> with you. <laughs>